Unfortunately, no, it requires something with a little more kick. Plutonium! Care package on the way. We are back on the channel with another World War II video gameplay and commentary. What is going on, YouTube? I am Dark Tail DeWise, aka Daddy Daycare, and you have found Noob to Sweaty Gaming, and we are on Saint Marie Dumont, and we have the newly nerfed. This gameplay comes from the end of the war machine dlc 2 community event and the funniest thing is they made another ar the volksturm gewehr and that thing got nerfed within a week and you take this itra or the itra burst whatever you want to call it this thing caught a nerf in four days but did they nerf the v2 out of it well we will find out in this gameplay but man they quote unquote said they've nerfed snipers to this point twice but in reality they haven't nerfed these dumbass snipers in six months and to tell you the truth, I'm getting kind of sick of playing this game because of it. I mean, in the beginning, we used to, or at least I used to, play different game modes. That's why you see me playing Capture the Flag, or you'll see me playing Gridiron like this. Why? Because the spawns are a bit more controlled. Somebody isn't going to suspect spawn directly inside your ass crack great Scott. literally like 75 percent of the other game modes in this game check the mine at the door nope it's the trip mine down the stairs we are pushing half time i had already entered the game and it was two and a half minutes into the game and now smack up the dynamic duo right here going into halftime we are back with the second half first half I believe I got my 10 gun kills so we are a little bit less than halfway to that daddy daycare v2 rocket but besides the sniping needing a very serious nerf i think that the war machine dlc 2 event was a successful one they successfully how do you say it tuned the game up you know these rework divisions they introduced new weapons now before they did the nerf to the itra i was watching exclusive ace and i will leave a link to the video down in the description below and basically pre-nerf the itra was very comparable to the m8a7 in black ops 3 which if you've been following my channel just happened to be my favorite gun in black ops 3 so it being comparable me to me it meant it was a a powerful gun but it was within it had its limitations and, and it had its its bright spots but it wasn't op you know what i mean like it did not need to be reworked within four days 
Look at downstairs. I dropped that Betty right in front of the dude and he still ran into it. <laughs> Can't call in the recon plane because there's a counter recon up. But we are primed in this window. We came right back to make the magic happen. Following the flow of the ball. We got the ball. And making sure my own ass is covered. Because now since we're recycling through streaks. I know for a fact I'm getting close. But there's only a minute 30 left. So I'm going to figure out real quick if I'm going to need to push this action. Or if I'm going to be able to maintain my pace and get the V2 rocket. But lo and behold, this gun is still nasty. And in the throwback list, there's a throwback playlist that's been going on for double XP in case you didn't know. And they brought back modern warfare classic, um, how do you say, basic skills. When you put the double tap to this gun, it is filthy. I'd rather put double tap as we get our V2 rocket. Calculations are correct. When this baby hits 88 miles per hour, you're gonna see some serious shit. <laughs> so obviously they didn't nerf the nuke out of it but I will try and bring you a gameplay from the throwback list before the game mode is not available anymore in World War 2 but just think of how bad sniping is now and then think of snipers being able to put stopping power on the sniper, oh my god, makes my blood boil. That's been my experience with it so far. I mean, you will literally run into a six man team of snipers and they are quick scoping with stopping power, which is part of the reason why I'm saying I am sick of sniping. And no, I'm not running to hardcore to avoid it. I've already done that. And I'm playing unorthodox game modes to keep me from poor spawns. Anyway, that is my video slash rant. If you are new, hit that like, hit that sub button. As always, you are never too old to live. I will see you on the next video.